Hi scholars! Welcome back to the supplementary video learning materials for English 7 with Sir Mel. Lesson 4. What are viewing materials and their purposes? Before we begin with different purposes of viewing materials, I want you to take note that these video materials in English are considered as text. In literature, a text is anything that can be read for the purpose 1. of telling a story or to entertain and others. Viewing materials or viewing texts differs only because it can be viewed or watched. Examples of viewing materials include movies, TV shows, commercials, stage plays, and many other materials in video format can be considered as viewing text. Now we got the idea of viewing text out of the way, let's go straight to the purposes. The term purpose, also known as aim, refers to a person's reason for writing. In the case of viewing texts, it refers to the person's reason for producing the material. It's what he or she hoped to accomplish with his or her work. These are four basic purposes for viewing materials. They are to inform, to entertain, to explain, and to persuade. Let's briefly talk about each of them. When viewing text seek to inform, they often provide facts, definitions, examples, and details about the history of a topic. Documentary fits well having this purpose. Another are top 10 of anything that gives facts and trivia. Next, when viewing texts seek to entertain, they provide amusement and enjoyment to their audience. They are typically viewed for leisure. Best examples of this type of purpose are the movies and series that we watch on one of the most popular streaming services to date. Thirdly, when viewing texts seek to explain, they often break down a concept or process into smaller parts or steps. These supplementary video learning materials in English are the best examples of this purpose. These videos seek to educate you and explain some of the concepts, topics, and lessons that are included in your module. Last one, when viewing texts seek to persuade, they often state arguments or positions directly and provide evidence to support those positions. They may state their positions with words like should, must, best, or worst, and they may include a call to action. Video programs of some well-known entrepreneurs are the best examples of this purpose because they want you to do something and they provide different reasons for you to believe them. Some viewing materials may have multiple purposes such as movies that may both present facts about history and want its audience to be entertained, or variety shows that seek to entertain but also call to a certain action its viewers. Now scholars, your question for this video, what purpose or purposes of viewing text the film Mandela, A Long Walk to Freedom has? Share your thoughts on the comment section below. Before we end, I'd like to remind you that you can go back at any point in the video lesson if you need time to understand the concept more. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to hit like if you learned something from this video and subscribe to the channel for more supplementary video learning materials for grade 7. This has been Sir Mel. See you next time!